All right, in today's video, we're going to be making some venison parmesan. Look at that right there. Jesse's with me today, and we're going to be commentating this video. It's going to be fun. Look at that, Jesse. Oh, look at all that cheese. It's turning my stomach. <laughs> all right, we're going to start off with some uh, venison scallopini. It's basically just some cuts from the back legs or your outside round, inside round, basically all the roast. Look at that meat right there, Jesse. That's, it's the only cutlets you want. <laughs> All right, throw that right there. Add some flour. The clean white stuff. Yeah, <laughs> mix it around. All right, Italian flavored breadcrumbs, look at that. It's not legit unless it's Italian flavored. Yeah. All right, two eggs from our chickens. I hand picked them myself. <laughs> Parsley, that's from the garden. Mix it's it around. Crazy. Look at that. That's fresh right there. Alright, you got all your ingredients, you throw that in there, make a mess. Wow. Did you clean that up after? Yeah, I did. Just quick. There you go, mix it around. Look One, at two, that. Three combo. That's what yeah, that's what you want it to look like. Look at that right there. Nice. Alright, now this is a slow motion version, just in case you guys didn't get that. It must have been too quick. Look at that. Flour. Look at me, look at those hands. Eggs. Breadcrumbs. <laughs> Alright, look at that. That's what you want it to look like. If it doesn't look like that, throw it out. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. Alright, butter, slow motion, in the pan. Look at that right there, Jess. Wow. You don't see that in cooking shows. That's olive oil for anyone who is guessing. Yep. Look at that. Slow motion butter melting action right there. Beautiful. All right, see see that pan right there? That's what you want it to look like. Once it looks like that, drop them in. The pan should be hot. <laughs> look at that. Look at that. Wow. Beautiful. That's what you want to see right there. All right. Turn them around. Uh, don't burn them like those two in the middle. But it's all right. Those are just the breadcrumbs. Look at that. But look at that. Look, I discarded the burnt one. All right, tomato sauce. This is important. Don't put too much. No, I'm just kidding. Look at that. Drown them. The more sugo, the better. That's right. Beautiful. Beautiful plate. All right, 350 degrees in the oven for 30 minutes, and then... The cheese. The cheese. Slow motion grind if you can. I'm, uh, I'm lactose intolerant. Uh, look at that. Look at that. I was watching. That is quality cheese right there. Oh yeah, I'll still eat it. Look, look, just in case you didn't get that. Look, this is what quality cheese looks like. Slow it down. Wow. Beautiful, beautiful cheese. All right, sprinkle it on slowly, just like that. See how slow I'm doing? It almost looks like it's in slow motion. Huh. Beautiful. It's worth the sacrifice. Look at that. That's exactly what you need. All right, grab your foil, cover it, put it in for another 10 minutes. Uncover it and look at this. Ready? Ooh, Dude. that's what you're looking for right there. Garnish it with some parsley. And you're gonna have a great time. Wow. I don't even think you need a fork. And that tasted great, didn't it? That was incredible. All right, guys, that's it for the, today's video. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe, like, and follow us on Instagram at RockyZone underscore. And check out our website. You'll find this recipe. It'll be on the link in bio. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. Ciao.